Get her. Go, 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 go. Meow. Meow. Go, 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 go. Oh, meow. Meow. Go, 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 go. Go, go. Go, go, go. They're so vicious. Wow, wow, wow. 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 Oh, I love my girls. Oh. Turn off the light, Johnny. Good morning, YouTube. -y. So, I thought I would uh, <laughs> take you for a little stroll. The new neighbors did a bunch of work on their spot yesterday, which was great because, you know, it makes it not ugly. It's not going to be ugly over here. They're going to clean it up and I don't have to do it. So that's a blessing. So they got a bunch of mowing done, right? And like I was saying, you know, because they know <laughs> where property lines are and they were being polite and it was all very good. And get this, walking up the road right there, and I didn't know it, but we got snapping turtles. Did you know they got snapping turtles in uh, Wisconsin. And hey, what is that bright ass red berry shit? Check that out. What is that? Who knows what those are? What is that berry? I got shorts on, so I'm not four wheel driving through Tick Central. You feel me? To go get an up close on those red berries. But that is very cool. It's from here, it's so bright, it almost looks like a, a camera, IR light or some shit. Anyway, yeah, snapping turtles walking in that little creek over there. It was crazy. I tried to get him to bite a stick and he kind of fucked with it and I let him go. I didn't want him getting fussy. So, yeah, they are doing some good cleanup. I mean, fuck, I still got mad cleanup right here to do my damn self, so. But I've been kind of putting this on hold over here because it's uh it's pretty. I don't I'm not tripping on the little bit of finish work that needs to be done, like this pile needs to be moved and I gotta get in here, get all that clean, but oh check this. Remember I was telling you how all the uh apples were all over the ground? They were there just yesterday. Somebody came in last night and had quite the feast. So I'm going to be getting cameras soon. I'm doing my homework now. I'm going to find the right systems, plural. But look, all those apples that were all over the ground are all gone. But my chores for today, weed whack that fence line, weed whack the barn, the house, and then I'm going to weed whack in here. And then in front of the house and my little raspberry bushes because <clears throat> I need gas for the uh, lawnmower and I don't want to go into town. I don't like going into town. I don't like going anywhere. I like staying right here. And so I'm going to put off <laughs> getting fuel as long as possible and uh, get all this weed whacking in here done. But I wanted to show you, can you see what's fixing to be raspberries, homie? So supposedly I got raspberries and blackberries growing on the property from the neighbor. Like I said, she knows about how there was potato planted. In fact, I'll show you. See, I bet I got down over here with the trimmy trim trim. It looks so much nicer. It was so nasty. Uh, look at look at the old videos. You remember how fucked up all this was? You know how hard it is to push all that wet material off? It was crazy. But, um... Fuck, I get sidetracked so easy. What the fuck was I saying? Uh, 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 uh. Oh, um... Once I get this this field and then over here 
Now we're a little longer because I didn't give this the buzz cut yet. This is all fat cut. But that goes down all the way around, all the way around, all the way around, all the way around the outside of a fence. Because see right here, and I'll zoom in, there's fence. You see the fence? That fence goes all the way around. And then on the outside of the fence from here to here, there's a track. Right? You can clearly see it compared to that side to this side. So that track goes all the way around and then the center's fucked. So like the nice neighbors were over here mowing yesterday and making their side look all nice, like I was saying, right? I'm very grateful that they're here because they're going to tend to it and they're not necessarily going to be here all the time. So it's uh, it's a great setup. And this is what I was talking about with the fence, right? I mean, I think property line is probably right here, right? And then you eyeball it to a stake at the road. It's mighty close to the trailer, right? All this is mine. Their property is just right at the driveway. It's a real skinny. And I told him, I said, you know, I'm not going to try to shove a fence up your ass if I don't have to. But if I do, I will. I mean, I could put a fence way back there, but that means I'm giving them all of this land. I'm not doing that. You can use it, right? This is my deal. I'm going to tell them, look, no fence unless I got dogs running amok and then I'll fence. But I'll put the fence way over here. You can use this land for your driveway. You don't own it, but you may use it if you clear the stumps from the center of this field and the stumps from the center of that field. And then you can walk the property. Husband, wife, you two can walk the property whenever you want. Now, any of the relatives want to come walk the property, you need to be with them. And if the relatives are coming over here without you, you need to call me and tell me because I don't know all the relatives, right? So out of courtesy, you know, I'm going to kind of leave this vastness because of that potato story. Oh, that's what I was getting at. If you follow the track all the way around, there's a field over there. See the split in the tree? That takes you to a field. And then over there, there's a split. And that takes you to another field. That field over there used to be potatoes. That one over there, I don't know. I'm sure I'll find out. May have been just for hay for all the fuck I know. So. Ooh, gunfire. Somebody's popping them off. This property, clearly, these folks lived off the land, right? You look at all this apples in, in these trees now where, you know, I can walk around nice and bug free. I mean, come on now. They're loaded. The trees are loaded. And I was telling the new neighbor, I said, you know, you need apples. And they're like, well, you know, <laughs> we got fruit trees too, right? That's just it. Everybody up here has got stuff. They don't really need mine because they got their own. You know what I'm saying? So it falls on the ground. The deer come in here and feed. There was a bunch of apples in here yesterday. From the wind that came through, they're all gone. So, and the weird thing is, <laughs> how come I don't see no deer droppings? All the apples are gone, but I don't see no deer shit. <laughs> was there not deer in here eating the apples? You tell me. Was somebody else in here eating the apples and the deer never got to them? I don't know. <laughs> now all of a sudden I'm a little uncomfortable. Oh, Yogi and Boo Boo. I don't need to be... <laughs> freaking out mama bear and her two cubs and they were the ones in here eating all the fucking apples right but the thing is i don't see no shits it's kind of weird how is it i mean here's an apple but the other day there was a ton of them out here they're all gone man what a difference the backside back here and i still gotta finish but i couldn't it was too thick of shit that i had already chopped that was everywhere Propane tank looks proper. I gotta go over here and see if there's a... 
bear shit is. Right? I got my pistola. I'll scare him off if I have to, but like I was saying, this is where the big bear shit was. And uh, this track right here, if I clear this, it's the same thing. There's a trail that goes this way that you could drive a car on and come out to the side road if you cleared all this fucking shit that's in the way. So it would be nothing for a bear to come walking through there or through this trail in the field because there's an opening in the fence over here wide enough to drive a car through. So these two tracks are easy access for a bear to come in. And if there's raspberries and shit, like right there, I think if, if I'm starting to remember what these plants look like, I think those are all raspberry bushes right there next to the barn. I don't know. And I haven't been in here in quite a, quite a while. That's the chicken coop and uh, rabbit cages and shit. So they were raising chickens and rabbits for food, right? Whether it's eggs or meat. And the stalls, clearly, there was uh, cattle, I'm sure. A couple heads, anyway. I clear-cut a lot of this down, way down, right? But see all that dry shit? I gotta move it. I gotta move all that dry shit that way, because you can't keep mowing over it. It's clog shit up but I'm gonna try to clear all this today this fence line on both sides at least over to the man cave or not the man cave but the uh <laughs> the, the auto shop but out here man look look there's only a couple of apples bink 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 and if you look at the other video there was a shit ton of apples everywhere how come I don't see no deer shits? Is that because they don't shit where they eat? Oh, look, 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 look. Can you see? Look at that. <laughs> oh. So, somebody done got hatched up up in the apple tree. How cool is that? See, this is the kind of shit that puts a smile on my face, man. Life, right? Living life gets me all choked up just talking about it because it makes me feel good, right? This tree is so loaded. These branches are so heavy, man. I mean, if you look at how skinny this one little branch is and it's got all this weight on it, man, it's crazy. That's why apple wood, apple trees grow so slow and they're so strong because their fruit is so fucking heavy. <sighs> and even look at the little guy. This is a newer apple tree and it's got red, red and green on them where it looks like most of these other apples are just going to stay green. They're not going to turn red, but this tree is going to get some red. I don't know. Clearly, they were protecting it from the deer, and I finally got all that shit cleaned up. I'm going to wipe all that out, wipe out the shit around this tree, and then I'm going to get in here and get all this shit all cleaned up in the center. This is supposed to be like a little horseshoe, and there's a like a little wheelbarrow or something in there, right? And that shit needs to be all cleared out, a little walkway. All that's going to get leveled off, all the shit around. The grapevine's going to get leveled off. I'm gonna start pulling all the big stones, like that stone and that stone and that stone, all the large stuff. I'm gonna line it out over by the house. And up here, Lake Michigan area, some of these stones glow under black light. Ooh, what is the shine in this stone? Can you see that? Look at the metal in there. Can you see that? Holy shit. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? There is metal shining inside that stone, clearly. I'm a rock guy. Look at that. I don't know what that is. So anyway, yeah, I'm going to get into playing with my rocks. <laughs> Johnny needs to get his rocks off. <laughs> and I know I got, where is it? You know what Jasper is? Red Jasper. Where's a good chunk of red jasper? Oh, look at this stuff. It's all kind of 
fish scaly shaley shit. That's what that is. I, I'm not sure, but I'll find out. This is just quartz. But uh, 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 where is the red jasper? I know I seen some. I think, hold on. Hold on, Johnny. Where did you see your jet? Oh, it might have been over here. See, all these big rocks are going to waste in here. I'm going to move all of these to where they can... Uh, somewhere in here is some jasper, red jasper. I probably looked right at it anyway. So, yeah, quick little tour. Still need to clean all this shit, but this is real fucked in here. This is where they put in a new septic, so... There's a sinkhole, stumps, all kinds of fucked up shit. So this is the last. But today, tidy up to those bricks. All around these edges. Get rid of... Oh, that's where the jasper was. I'm going to see all these bricks. I'm going to move all this so I can mow right up to the tree. And all these rocks, I'm going to move them. But there's red jasper in here. And there's a couple of dead birdies too. I put a couple of the carcasses in there where the uh, where they crashed into the fucking house. Is that it? There's red jasper somewhere, but I don't. When I find it, <laughs> I'll uh, show you fools. But yeah, I'm gonna pick up all these rocks because I can't mow in here. These rocks fuck up the lawnmower. Something fierce. And like I said, some of these rocks will glow with the black light. And I'll, uh, I'll show you fools at nighttime after I get everything all moved. It's like I got all these bricks that I cleaned up. You can see there's still some that were shoved, made like a circle around the base. Fuck all that. I'm going to get rid of all that shit, mow it, make it clean, and then refurb those bricks for something else. I like this little fuzz in here, but I'm going to clean this up. I stuck that little tricycle. That used to be a fire pit that's all smashed down. I'm going to try to bend that back up. So, yeah, I got cool little projects, man. This is helps my uh, mood, right? My mental health, as they say, is um, coming out here and uh, getting busy beautifying and cleaning and seeing potential, I'll get rid of all this old string right here for this clothesline. And I got brand new white parachute cord. I'll restring all that. And then I'll probably run something from there to the stump, from the stump to the fucking grapevine, right? There's already something that goes from, from stump to this tree, this fucking cable with the chimey on it. And then there's this bracket right here. So, and I can see where at one time... Somebody had this mess, and this mess actually has, get this. <laughs> I don't know who the fuck did all this, but there was actually a pulley on here to, it probably went over here, <laughs> right? Like this. I don't know, fuck Johnny the camera. See, from here to here with that pulley so you could get your shit, <laughs> hang your shit up and, uh, Oh, it's so funny. Hold on. Ooh, ooh, can we? Sorry. Hold on. There. Ow. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. I'm just fucking around, having fun. And that was just something that was here when I moved in. But if you look back at the winter stuff, all this was so jacked already. I mean, it was nasty. And now... It needs a little straightening up. Sure is pretty, man. I really do love it here. I see such life, such potential, such critters and and people and kids laughing and screaming and playing and enjoying themselves, you know, during the summer and the spring. In the fall and then winter, you hunker in and there'll be walkways, covered walkways that go from here to there, from there to there, from there to the steel building, a walkway that goes to the barn. And we're talking covered walkway, right, with 
wainscot four feet high on each side and then open so that you could see out. But when the snow piles up, you got a cleared walkway. You're not plowing shit, right? It's just labor. And the, the land has all the material I need. I just need labor and an investment in a sawmill. That's it. Well, not quite that's it, but close enough. You know what I'm saying. So, back to the homestead. <laughs> I got <laughs> some little lights I'm going to fuck with. I got some black light shit I want to fuck with. But the problem with the black light stuff, that really brings the bugs. And I'm over the fucking bugs. So now I'm not lighting up the house anymore. I light up the fucking shop and let the bugs go over there. Oh, it's so beautiful. Are you kidding me? Remember what I said about the whistle? You ain't heard no whistling. Now watch. Are you going to fuck me off? Come on. No, Mr. Crow. I'm getting stood up. Are you laughing? 20 minutes in, nobody's even at to the, this part of the video. I guess they're not going to play with me again. Maybe because they can see the camera. Johnny, you're crazy. Just living life, man, like a little kid, having fun. Throwing whistles at the wind. What are you doing? All right, y'all, have a beautiful day.